Tonight we are learning murdered Downey police officer Ricardo Galvez spent his last days as a good Samaritan. While new details are revealed about the young man accused of killing him, KCAL 9's Tom Wade is live outside police headquarters with more on the officer who is being remembered for his big heart. Tom. And Elsa, we'll get to that in just a few seconds here. But first, I got to tell you that the two arrests that were made of the three were two brothers, and they are now going to face a judge on Monday. Take a look behind me here. This is the memorial, the Downey Police Department. It has been growing all day and now into the night. Family and friends have been here along with complete strangers to pay their respects. It is close to home. Could happen to anybody. Tonight, emotions are still raw in Downey in the wake of Officer Ricardo Galvez's murder. Galvez was gunned down in his parking spot as he was leaving the station Wednesday night. Detectives say three young men killed him during a failed robbery. The memorial outside Downey Police Headquarters continues to grow. I mean, it could happen to anybody, but still, it shouldn't have happened to him, period. And tonight we're learning more about Galvez's big heart and the veteran Marine's random acts of kindness. This Instagram post from his account details an encounter with a woman he pulled over. So the other night I came across a woman who touched my heart. During a traffic stop, she was stopped for expired registration. As I asked for all of her information, she told me the reason she had not been able to pay for her registration was because her husband had recently passed away. Galvez let the woman go with a warning and then this. So today I walked into the auto AAA club and paid for her expired registration. I am sharing the story with everyone, not for recognition. I am blessed and this lady touched my heart. He was a young gentleman that had a future, bright future ahead of him. So it just makes me sad. Today, 16-year-old Abel Diaz was arraigned in connection with Galvez's murder. The judge would not allow us to show his face. Two other men, 18-year-old Stephen Knott and 21-year-old Jeremy Alvarez, will face a judge on Monday. Downey Police Department, you know, they're here to defend and protect us all the time. I, I mean, it's, it's ironic that they would kill him right in front of the police department. That just doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense to a lot of people. Abel Diaz, the one that was arraigned today, the teen, he is being held on $1 million bond. Reporting live in Downey, Elsa and Susie, back to you. All right, Tom, thank you very much for that.